Oh, this ability doesn't consume all the arrows that he's shooting. That's cool. I was a bit concerned, but... Hey everybody, welcome to this new episode of Solaris Ray playing RimWorld with the Crashers against the Shattered Empire. Alright, in the previous episode we managed to fulfill a quest to try to recuperate a blue tech print. And we also grabbed a prisoner <laughs> in, in the way, apparently it's a, it's a shadow guy. So we, um, we're gonna make sure that this guy survives and we can, we can put him in prison and all that stuff. Um, before the, the, the caravan arrives, so we're gonna need to make sure that the prison is ready for him. So obviously we're gonna take the bed, we're gonna move it there, make sure that this guy sleep away, and uh, that uh, this is like a prison. Um, and we're gonna make sure that he, he survives, and then, you know, um, having the devil strand being planted, and continue the fortification of the base, doing the research, you know, continuing towards our goal, which is pretty cool. Uh, by the way, guys, if you enjoyed the series, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. That uh, means a lot to me. It helps uh, uh, the, the algorithm uh, defining if the video is pretty good and it takes two seconds of your time. If you have any suggestions or things that you want to see in the playthrough, feel free to put it in the comment section below. All right, let's get started. Um, so let's uh, grab uh, the, the speed a little bit faster there. That would be cool. And actually, I think what we're gonna do, I'm gonna move things along a little bit faster. I know that in the previous episode, um, I played a little bit more along and it was a longer episode. So we're gonna try to stay on time and to uh, to get the things moving pretty quickly. All right, so that's pretty good, guys. We we have the cavern that arrived. Uh, we have Kazan that is escorting the guy in prison. Uh, he vanquishes infection, so he's gonna be fine. And we're gonna see, so I have 23 in resistance, so we're gonna reduce the resistance. So we're gonna ask Kazan to do that because she's the warden. Okay, we're gonna need to be careful because those vents are not super good uh, to prevent people, um, you know, from escaping. <laughs> Mad world boy. Okay. Oh, hockey's okay. Uh, so yeah, and also I ask Stingray, you know, to focus on the rice and Hawk to focus on the devil strand. So obviously, I'm gonna need to make sure that he can go to bed. Actually, what I could do if I was clever. I could go in here and uh, do the regrowth seed area and just extend. It, it should work. Okay. Okay, so it can actually. Oops, sorry. But that that also depends if he. There you go. So technically now, if I wake him up, he should be able to go in his bed. Perfect. So he can continue working. Okay. Ah, oh, yeah, that's the boar. Uh, the boy is somewhere outside. Manhunter pack, what is that? Oh, look at that. Alpha beavers. Alright, and they have Scaria apparently. But prevent us from eating their meat. Great. <laughs> okay, so where are they going? Okay, the boy is coming there. So the boy is gonna die. Um, yeah, Combo is not necessarily in a mood to pick a fight right now. So, I'm just wondering if we... Hmm. 
I mean, a few of them will die. But there is a lot, because we have a fair amount of traps. Uh, let's see how we go. How many are they? Oh, there's, a, there's, a, there's a fair amount. Um, and uh, I'm not sure if I want to deal with this uh, now, actually. So, I gotta close the door. Yeah, it took two traps to kill the boar, so hey, you got, the traps are not gonna... Okay. So there you go, they're they gonna stay outside, you know, and maybe what I would do is like everybody, you know, everybody stay in the safe area for now. Alright, and what I could do as well is make sure that the safe area also includes um, yeah this is not necessarily safe per se but it's uh they don't ha they don't have to go outside right and potentially we can have people here shooting them up you know sh shooting at them but it's gonna waste some arrows obviously But at least people can rest, they can replenish themselves. I, I don't need to uh, to have combo, you know, uh, waking up in the middle of the night. He's, he's tired. Okay, what is Bones doing? She's disturbing people in their sleep. Uh, that's, that's not super great. Oh, okay. We don't have Kim Fuel? Okay, can you uh, prioritize doing that? That's gonna be nice. Okay, so he's gonna feed someone. Who's gonna feed? Okay, he's gonna feed the prisoner. Perfect. We need more energy. Alright. Okay, I want to make sure that Bone has a... Uh... Yep, so she's gonna relax socially and all that stuff. Cool. Combo is gonna refuel. And then I'm gonna ask Combo to take care of those... Uh... What is that? It's a quest? Ah, it's the Shadow Empire again. The Consul of Foncas, uh, Kumos of the Shadow Empire wishes to add some life to his court by showing off, showing off some goofy jesters. He asks you to send, to lend him one colonist to serve for seven days. Yeah, that's pretty easy, but I'm not doing anything for the Shadow Empire. Like, uh, it, it, they are our enemies. Like, we're not, we're not doing that. Okay, so he's gonna need to relax a little bit more socially. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Hawk, 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 hawk. My friend, you are working on the regrowth area, and that's what you're working on. Okay, now combo, you, you're not super happy and I need you happy, okay? So you're gonna take some extra re re uh, recreation. And then I'm gonna send you at war. Oh, a large meteorite of granite, I presume. Yeah, great. <laughs> su super great. All right, thank you. We, we have granite, but uh, fell from the sky. This is amazing, guys. Okay, what is Bone doing? Yeah, it's killing the dead. Okay, so can you prioritize, uh, you know, working on the materials? It's relaxing. What is Hawk doing? He's meditating. Okay. And we have cloth. Cool. Awesome. 
All right. Okay, so now my question is like, to take care of all those animals, I want uh, Combo to do it. I'm gonna ask them to go through there. Uh, I don't think it's gonna need an animal or something. I don't necessarily think. Um, so let's see what, uh, he has a club, that should be fine. I gotta ask him to go there. Where is Hawk? He's still meditating apparently. That's for his psychic focus, but that's fine. I'm gonna ask him to come in here. Oh, complex clothing is done. Perfect. Okay. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna ask this to be open. We're gonna open it. Uh, we're gonna have Hawk staying there. Stingray as well could potentially help. Where is Stingray? Come here. Could put some, you know, uh, traps. Okay, so they, they are getting uh, traps. Okay. Perfect. Okay. Ah, it didn't go for the trap. Okay. That's fine. And now we're going to say regenerate to him. Okay, now you can go. Uh, I mean, he, do he doesn't need to recharge. He has a bunch of... So, end load. And reload. And take it. And then, boom. Yeah, I, I like the way that it works, actually. Uh, he unequipped the, the bow. That's, that's a little bit annoying, really. Oh, this ability doesn't consume all the arrows that he's shooting. That's cool. I was a bit concerned, but... Yeah, you see it didn't decrease for the amount of the, the bows where he shot. Yeah, I, I have no worries for combo. He's gonna be fine. This is nothing for him. Maybe what we can do is a spin blade. Take a fair amount of damage, but... Okay, so now we're gonna shoot like... Okay, another one died. Wow. Alfie... Alfie is trying to help. Wow. Yeah, the regeneration is keeping him above. Ah, combo is gay. It's like this is a murdering machine. Okay, another. Boom. Okay, so again, we're gonna do the same thing. We're gonna unload. We're gonna reload. Then apparently, yeah, we're gonna do this. Gonna re equip, which is kind of unfortunate. And then we're gonna maximize the arrows that we have by using this ability. So we have 12, right? Let's see how much he uses. You see, zero because it's, it's, it's counted as stamina. So it's not using any uh, ammunition. That's pretty good, actually. There you go. So we kill them all. It seems like we can we can recuperate their meat. I don't see anything that prevents us from doing so. Yeah. Uh, 
There you go. Now, does he have regeneration? No, he doesn't. Okay, so where is Hawk? Okay. Um, gotta guess regeneration. Just stay where you are. Okay. Now that he has regeneration, he is gonna be perfectly fine. I'm pretty sure he wants to rest. I, I, I think he fell in the ground. That's why he dropped the club. Right? He, I think he fell in the the ground and he um and he woke up immediately because of uh of regeneration. So yeah, it's gonna be fine. Okay, so we're still doing the Devil Strand. And he's gonna go to sleep. Critical Alert. Stingray and Bones. Okay, Bo Bone, she, she has been working non-stop uh, on this. So she did, uh, she does have a break, that's for sure. What about um, Stingray? Yeah, it's gonna be fine. Okay, so now she's sleeping. Okay, so she's gonna be fine. We're gonna need to hold all those bodies uh, so we can butcher them and recuperate their lever and all that stuff. But uh, yeah, that, that was an interesting event. And if that is the case, if we begin to have meat, we're gonna change the recipe, right? We're gonna put that in pose and we're gonna do some lavish meals, okay? So we have Stingray taking care of the rice and we have Hawk taking care of the Devil's Strand for magic. That's right. And technically we could have more cotton. We could, now that we have cloth, that's that's super cool. That is actually super, super cool. Another thing as well that we can do, we should be able to produce... Uh, do, 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 electric Taylor Bench, that's right. So we're gonna put that here maybe, or we could put that there, but yeah. Let's put it there, that's fine. Boom. So this is gonna allow us to make clothing and, and pretty cool things like that. Yeah. And now we are working on the nutrient paste. So the nutrient paste is gonna have to be here. So we're gonna break down this. And around there, we're gonna have uh, the hoppers. We're gonna have to condense this, maybe. We're gonna have the hoppers around there. And uh, that's gonna be way more efficient. And that means that we will only be doing fine meals or... Uh, of, uh, we can have the use of simple meals because the nutrient paste gives a penalty in the mood, but it also saves way more resources because it only consumes six units of, of uh, resource instead of 10 with a simple meal, right? So that's uh, that's an, another important thing. Um, also, I'm not going to give uh, so much relaxation to combo. And now that we, get, we got rid of the threat, and that's why we are not holding things, is because we need to end restrict some people. And let's... So they, like that, they can actually grab the corpses, and Hawk is going to take care of the devil's strength. That's Hawk's priority. I'm posing his, his meditation kind of thing at the moment, right? That's that's perfectly fine uh, by my uh, by me. We need to have those Devil Strand uh, going ASAP because they're gonna take a long time, a long, 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 long time to uh, to grow. Okay, so he's he's feeding his his, his mate, and now he's meditating. Okay, that's perfectly fine. I think I could make a sculpture for him, uh, so like that when he can't meditate, um, when he can't meditate at the tree, he can still meditate there. And there, there's things for this. I think it's in yeah. Okay, so that's pretty large. Yeah, 
So this is this is not gonna work out because it needs to be in nature to do it. But uh... oh wow, jeez. Yeah, it's it's almost like the anima tree. Yeah, okay. So it's it's the same principle. Jeez, okay. Oh, it's fine. All right. So let's see what kind of thing can we do. Oh yeah, we can do dusters. We can do. Okay, so we can do almost everything now that we we were doing before. We can do hats. We can do. Uh, dusters, jackets. So we don't necessarily need the crafter now, right? Like this crafting spot. And that's for doing smoke leaves and things like that. But we, we don't necessarily need this because we can do every all that, all that elsewhere. So we're just going to get rid of it. We're just going to get rid of it. And... Medium explosive. That's pretty cool. There's a lot of cool stuff. Um, okay, well, potentially what, what would be nice, um, the duster, coal and heat, okay, well, it's not super cold at the moment, um, I mean, it's 24 degrees, that's, that, that's okay, what about the parka? Yeah, insulation with uh, against cold, it, it helps. Staying warm in the coldest temperature, yeah, that's maybe a little bit uh, too extreme. Uh, yeah, 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 tribal. Well, okay, maybe let's make a, a t-shirt. Yeah, shoulder insulation. Yeah, it's just it's just you have better clothes, really. Um, yeah, and we can do it out of cloth. So let's say just cloth, right? And uh, any worker. So I would like to have one, maybe eight. Let's say, until you have eight. And then the same thing for pants. Do it until you have eight. And, and you just do it out of cloth. All right. All right, let's do this. We're gonna have a chair. You see, and now we are grabbing the bodies. Oh, you you can. I uh, <laughs> she can't. She can't hold things. That, that that's uh, that's what I thought. Okay, so let's um let's butcher. All right, because we're gonna need um to free some space. Ah, come on. Four of your tribes people have gotten sick from the Mechanites. Kaz and Bones, Tingri and Alexio. This this is not good because the, this disease uh, make them more sleepy. Shanks. It makes them more sleepy. Uh, it slows them down. Uh, enfin, actually, it, it increases their movement, sorry, but it um yeah it, it requires them to sleep way more than what is required so okay i think stingray contracted it as well jeez that that guy cannot have a break he can't have a break seriously where is where is hawk okay he's going inside that's fine you see, and now he's gonna go rest because he's he's tired. Okay, so he's gonna try to tend, but what what I'm wanting to see is can cure disease help cure this stuff? Okay, just want to cast in, okay. Mm. 
he hasn't done it, right? Okay, J just a sec, uh, my friend. Just a sec. Go here. Alright. And now, try to cast Cure Disease on her. I want to see if it works. No, it doesn't. But it, ga it gives her immunity. Okay, this is interesting. It gives her a 15% uh, better immunity. But I'm not sure if that's that will help. It takes a long time to get rid of uh, of this disease. Like a long time. You see, and uh, and she she's gonna be. Uh, you can just tend to them. Like cure disease is not gonna help. I don't think it will. I'm just gonna try. You know, cure disease costs twenty one mana. Okay, so now I mean you know. She has a good tending. It's gonna take time, but mm. where is he going? He's gonna take care of Stingray. He's gonna take care of, of the different people. How is this dude going? Yeah. Did we work on on reducing his? Uh, yeah, we did. Okay, that's fine. We could sell him as a slave, but honestly, he has more value to us than uh, you know, alive than uh, of, uh, as a as a slave and anything else now this is unfortunate because that forces hawk to take care of of, of everybody like elixir for example you know like uh uh it doesn't really matter if he's affected by uh the mechanites because he's in bed all the time but you know cast and stingray bones they're gonna be affected so And she's butchering non-stop. <laughs> we have so much meat. Okay, can you can you hold this out of the way, please? I don't I don't want the call to, to go out. Okay, cool. Don't put it in there. This is not a storage area. Jeez. Oh my gosh. Yeah, and Katzen is working non-stop. She's butchering, 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 butchering. Can, can you hold this out of the way? I don't want the meat to block the door. Okay, if you want, put, put it somewhere else. Jeez. Yeah, keep this area clean, that's very important. Okay, so she's gonna need a, a, a break, actually. So we, we're just gonna add her to, to have a, a good rest. Now, uh, is she a decent cook? Yeah, she's not too bad at cooking. She's not the best at cooking. So she could give food poisoning to people. Okay, so Buffalo is completely healed. Hopefully his mood is going to be better. Okay, now she's going to feed Buffalo, I guess. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. So Hawk is taking care of Alexio. That's why it's I wanted him to have access to the room so he can at least tend to the other people while he's working on the Devil Strand. Nicole is, is actually being our new researcher and she has made some very good progress. I mean, 11.19, when she was starting, she was at 9.5 or something, right? And I haven't even given her the um, the tech. Yeah, she can, she can apply that before she goes to bed. So hopefully that's gonna give her a significant boost. So it's gonna make her a better researcher. Uh, which is going to be fantastic for us. Okay, let's see. 
Okay, so she's going there. Let's speed up the thing. Okay, so she's applying it. And here you go. Okay, she had that little boost. I think she was at 11.19 and now she's at 11.33. Okay, and we have brain wiring. Right? Yeah, so it gave 2000 experience. Okay, and it locked this, uh, this research halfway through, I think it does. Yeah, brain wiring, right? Yeah, so we need multiple uh, things to be researched, but we could potentially research that now, which will uh, unlock, you know, joy wire, pen stopper, and mind screw. But pain stopper can be pretty good on people like combo, you know, like to make sure that they fight until the end, right? Um, but after they could die as well, so there's, there's a, a drawback on that as well. This will spoil, yeah. Okay, so she, she doesn't need a lot of sleep. I, I gotta need to make sure that she doesn't uh, put up the sleep of other people. And if, if honestly, if you um, just do that, eat, and after I'm gonna put you again on, on doing the materials, because she's a quick sleeper, which is absolutely amazing. Okay, so I'm gonna get her to do the, the sandstone and and the granite and all that stuff. She's a hole, huh? And she doesn't have the the mechanite. Now she has a peg leg, but uh, who 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 cares? Okay, who cares, guys? Who cares? All right, so we're gonna let her sleep, and I want the granite to come so we can. Uh, Oh, okay, so it's finished. So now I presume that the, the bot is going to be working on the the new area, right? That's going to be uh, that's going to be good. Perfect. Yeah. Okay. See? Ah. Relationship. A group of islanders uh, are passing by. There are people who have relationship with your tribe or prisoners in the area. So it's Van Rees, the brother of Stingray. Okay. Cool. All right. Hopefully they, hopefully they will enjoy their stay. Oh, no, they're just passing by. Okay, well, that's fine. They can, they can pass. They can be here if they want. That's perfectly fine by, by me. Okay, so she's gonna consume a meal. She's gonna feed the prisoner. We want to keep his mood high. And now she's doing some lavish meals. Perfect. So now that she's free, free the area, I just micromanaging a little bit. Are she reducing the resistance? Uh, that's that's perfectly fine. Gonna let her do that. It's gonna take her a while to reduce uh, his resistances uh, significantly. It's at 15.1. Now, oh, 12.9. That's a lot. I presume that is because there is a, a pretty good uh, mood boost. Now, it's at 55, right? So that's pretty okay. And we are going through a lot of meat, right? And people are, are loving the lavish meals, right? Okay, I think he's holding the thing out of the bad area, which is great. I love it. Everything makes sense. Is there still animals? No, everything are there, so she's going to be able to butcher. Poor quality in storage. Yeah, 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 that's fine. That, that's exactly what I want. Like, I don't want to have awful... Actually, I don't even want to have awful weapons and things like that, to be quite frank. Um, everything that is awful, you, you like, they, they can just go. You know, all, all the weapons that are awful quality, you know, like awful uh, to poor quality, just just go. Which means that here, 
Yeah, I think it should be fine. Uh, what is she doing? Pawning the bow. Yeah. Oh, okay, so the bot was redoing this. Okay. Uh, by the way, like, combo, can, can you actually... Oh, he's holding the gladius and all that stuff. So everything that is bad is going to get out of the storage area, which makes sense. No empty spot. This, okay, okay. <laughs> That's the reason. Uh, we need to recuperate those bodies before they rot. Okay, butcher. Ten hours, fourteen hours. Okay, so hold this. No empty accessible spots. They should. I mean, unless someone has already something planned there to be put. I mean, we are we're, we have a lot of things there in that room, but uh, we are taking the bodies off, the things are moving, so yeah, we should be fine. Da -da 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 -da. Great. Perfect, look at that. Okay, so he's moving the things away, she's cleaning. Okay, uh, do we still have any... Yep, so we have all the bodies, so we have all the meat. That's perfect. We have potatoes. Oh, she's giving a lavish meal to bu Buffalo. I hope that he's gonna enjoy it. Okay, so she's just doing that meal and now she's going to bed. Awesome. Okay, who is having a, a bad time? Okay, Stingray and Bone. Where is Bone? What is she doing there? Let's go to bed in the, in the normal area. Okay, there you go. Okay, where is Hawk? He's sleeping. Perfect. And you see the devil strain is uh is advancing right like he still has uh, need to to do some work but uh you know it, it's gonna progress very slow because we don't have an hydroponic bay etc so it's gonna progress fairly slow so that's why i wanted to make sure that this is gonna be uh done and we have an eclipse so that's gonna be done even slower here you go <laughs> and you see like those lavish meals are, are going super fast I mean, it's incredible. Like, people are eating them, and that's 10 resources. Like, I find that's 20 resources. This is insane. Okay, so she's perturbing, like, people sleep, which is kind of annoying. And again, I need to fix that. Well, if she's awake already, what time is it? 3 a.m.? She's already awake, so she could potentially. Uh, do the recreation a bit sooner, right? So she's gonna she's gonna have a pretty good re recreation. So she's gonna look at the telescope and all that stuff. And and what I discovered, Gaffa, well, I didn't know before, is uh, you know, if the more distractions you have, you know, telescope. You know, a game there, chest, different things. The more distractions you have, the 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 more efficient the recreation will be, and and it will really help them. Re it will really help the the pawns keep their mood high. All right, so that's that's very cool. Okay, so we don't have any cam fuel left, so I'm gonna ask her to work on the cam fuel. See, and now she, she is using it. So, what is the beer? We may want to have more cam fuel. Let's say until we have 70 cam fuel. Because we're, it's not gonna. Cam fuel is not gonna disappear, right? So, just work on the cam fuel. 
Because we need to make sure that we have enough energy. Perfect. Okay, boom. Uh, she's going to provide a lavish meal, meal to, to the prisoner. Jeez. The guy is... I hope that he's having a good mood, huh? Because... Look at that. But it, it's clever what she's doing because... Uh, if the guy has a good mood, that means that he's going to convert faster. So actually, it's pretty good what she's doing. Yeah, that's fine. I don't I don't want those stuff. Like, uh, it can stay outside. We uh, we don't want to have uh, other things that is poor, deteriorated. It's, it's considered, like, rattled. So... Okay. Okay, so we almost finished doing the Devil Strand. You see, and like Hawk is 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 pretty good at it, right? Like he's is like Okay, he's gonna eat a lavish meal. Okay. That's fine. Yeah, people are just eating lavish meals, right? Like, but that, that's the only meal that there is left. There is no simple meals anyway. So, and that that's perfectly fine. Okay. And as I said, like, even if we're going to be doing the nutrient pass, which we're going to have very shortly, uh, being able to do lavish meals and fine meals is going to be very important for the mood of the colonists. We ju we don't want to rely just on nutrient paste. Right? It's very important. Okay, so things are moving along pretty nicely. Okay. And here you go. So, we have now the nutrient paste. So, let's see what is going to be the next... Okay, armor plate. Okay, so we are advancing pretty well. And after we could potentially have as well long blades. Like sword and spears and, and things like that, which could be pretty cool. But one thing that I would like us to begin to explore... Is to have sterile materials. Because this is... If we put sterile materials... Um, and I think that requires steel, and it requires a lot of steel. But if we can put sterile materials on the research area, which we have a dedicated one now, this is going to give a big boost uh, for Nicole when she research, which is going to help for everything else, right? It's going to help for magic. It's going to help for, you know, microelectronics thermal, machining, everything else, which those ones are going to be the big one, right? Macroelectronics is 6,000, geothermal is 6,400, right? So before doing those big, long research, we're going to need to make sure that we can actually, um, you know, research quickly. And I think I'm going to pause the video here, guys. It's 43 minutes. So I hope that you enjoyed the content. If you did, don't forget to leave a like. That means a lot to me. I hope that you're going to have a wonderful day. And I will catch you on the next video. Bye.